Hi, I'm Andrew McDonald, and I'm a shoemaker. I started making shoes about 25 years ago. I was just inspired by the idea of the craft process. That was very attractive. That what I was producing had a very tangible effect on the people who wore them. I was in some way involved in improving the quality of people's life by creating shoes that fit well, uh, which are designed to last, which are sustainable. It involves working with your hands, involves working with your mind, and also involves working with your imagination. That's what I like about working with my hands. You know? You're moving. It's a great way to move thoughts, feelings through your body. Always looking at silhouettes, always looking at ways to, looking at people, looking at ways that you can create footwear that is transformational or complementary or an extension of their personality or create something that becomes more reflective of their personality. That you're introducing another layer to who they are. I find the more you do it, the, 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 more, the more layers within the craft process, within the design process that you need to investigate. The older I get, the more I realise I don't know. But that's, that's, that's the beauty of it. I'm always searching for, for new ideas, whether it's art, it's film, literature. I'm inspired by other artists. I'm inspired by nature. And without nature, you know, I might be nothing really. You know, making shoes, it's a problem solving exercise. You're constantly trying to figure out how can I achieve this result um, in these circumstances or this material. I think if you continually got that desire to want to solve the problem, you can make shoes forever. Well, in my eyes, I think someone as an artist is. is someone who's grappling with the sense concept. But I think artistry is it's, it's, it's a very pure uh, form of design. I might be pursuing the life of an artist, but I mean, I prefer to see myself in life being a craftsperson.